Wow, wow. I see my I see my future down there. Holy smokes, it's down that path. I can't believe how good life is going to be. Well, hi, well, hi, hey. I just took a look at my future through these binoculars. And yes, it is kind of a little trick, a game that I'm playing, but I'm envisioning what would my future be like? What would be the path that I want to take so that I can have all the things that I want in life that really bring me joy? Now, I wonder if you're in a situation like that too, where you're wondering, what is my future going to be like? I don't know where I'm heading. Well, I'm going to tell you a quick story just to get started with that thought is that I love wellness and I've worked in wellness forever and I love it, it's my passion and my joy, but all of a sudden it wasn't fun anymore. And I didn't know why I was so miserable doing the thing I loved. Well, just hold that thought, I'm going to come back to that in a minute because I really want to help you today. I want you to think about three things that you're going to be able to do to kind of get yourself unstuck and on that path to your great future. The first one is just what is the vision that you hold for your future? And you can gather that vision. It's usually the things that you've been thinking about that are so much fun and you just wish you could do all the time. That's probably a good beginning step. I just use this as a trick, a tool, to say what would it look like if I projected myself five, ten years down the line? So you can do that too. So first, figure out what is your vision, what's your dream. Secondly, when you're pretending to have that dream, how does it feel? and really cultivate the feeling right here because that's going to tell you a lot about whether that's good for you or not. But it should be because your dream is there and you're feeling good. Third step is to practice that feeling. You can do it by meditation, yoga, uh, relaxation, taking a walk in the country, all those wonderful things that allow you to relax and just feel and dream. So you have those three steps. Find your vision, find the feeling, practice the feeling. Back to my story. I had lost the good feeling, so I had to change. And what did I do? I changed, I left my job, and I jumped into having my own wellness business. And it gave me the freedom, flexibility, time, creativity, all came back to me. And I knew that that was the best thing that I needed to do. So when you follow the feeling, which I did, Negative, I found out how to make it positive, changed it to positive, and I was on my path again, on the path to success. So if you are needing some help getting on your path to success, you want to climb on board, please email or call me. Let's get together. I'll give you a free consultation, and we'll help get you unstuck and on your way. So hope this was useful today. Please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to do that because we'll have lots more videos coming. And have a great dreamy day.